now what we're going to do is we're going to sand the, the fill spots. Now there's two options when it comes to sanding. You can hand sand or you can use um, um, a palm sander or an orbital sander. In our case we use orbital sanders. Why? Because all of this pre-primed trim, it has a texture to it. If you're ever working with pre-primed MDF, feel it. The, the prime job is always inconsistent. And so the reason why we use an orbital and we have 220 grit on that orbital is that it polishes the surface so that we're not dealing with any sort of texture inconsistencies provided by the manufacturer. We kind of put it down to our own nice polished texture and then we can create our own texture with the whatever paint we're using. So the next thing that you have to worry about is volcanoes. Something that we are um, vulnerable to, I guess, is finished carpenters using you know, nail guns that are really bad and so they explode the MDF inside that we can't do anything to fix. All we can do is fill the holes and sand them. And if there's any sort of volcano beneath that surface that is revealed once we paint, um, then you know it's gonna be revealed usually and the ceilings are really low and the light is focused right on here that it reveals any sort of inconsistency, which I've said before, what painters try and do is we try and provide consistency. So Mason's going to do a quick little demonstration of how to sand a door jam. So one thing you'll see, the, he didn't go too close to the wall here because the, the side of the orbital will totally cut that drywall up. So he stays away from that. And this texture is super nice and smooth now. And he did it in a super fast time. One thing we also have to worry about that an orbital will not get is the edges. Okay, there we go. So you can see that this is a bare MDF edge. Bare MDF, straight out of the saw, is a horrible surface to try and make smooth. So um, it's super important to polish it nicely with the 220 grit. And then once it's painted, it's not going to suck up paint super quick and be rough when you try and clean it. So we sand the edges really nicely before.